Good you watching Fini Only Mans of the Weekly Reset live stream. Not sure how long you heard my uh, improvised uh, opening music. Well, we can now listen to the opening music from Valhalla. Of course, we're double checking, whacking if the stream is live. And um, we know now what it says live. You're great minds, you know, and thanks for saying that. Uh, are we live everywhere? I think we are. So that's great. That's great. Um, so yeah, we're go of course gonna check. It's one week after the Forgotten Saga DLC. I'm still uh, not done with it. Far from it, actually. Um, so the idea is to check Reda, see what he has. Maybe there are some Helix items. Like, there are three item packs in the game files that they can just switch on. There's one weapon pack in the game files as well that they can just switch on. So, maybe they, they drop something right now. That's why I rebooted the game. So, uh, we actually have a chance at that. Good to see Black Dragon, Joel, Jonathan and Daniel. Thanks as well for joining Assassin Pufferfish. That's a cool name. Oh no, I'm still like uh, <laughs> seeing the, um, the stuff there. Let's see. I think I am... Well prepared, like si si semi well prepared. How many times have you completed Forgotten Saga? So, um, I completed it, of course, last stream. That was the first time. Um, and I actually haven't, like, been, like, trying to complete it since. I want to, like, try that for uh, streams. Also because, um, of course, you cannot get the chest armor from this set without actually... Uh, oh. It's empty. Ooh. Uh, without actually completing the DLC. Oh, it's a werewolf. I think this is the first time we see the phoenix. Might be wrong about that. Soul's gift. With the divine quality stuff, I, I have a hard time seeing it. W increase range range while aiming while moving. I just don't know which one this is. Soul's gift. Increase range range while aiming while moving. It's like an older one. Sounds like an older one. And the... Uh, Draugr said mount, which is kind of cool. Descartes, good to see you as always. Nathan Wilson. Yeah. <laughs> Nathan Wilson. Uh, Nathan Wilson. For people who don't know, I just joined the IGN Benelux uh, Dutch podcast. So I was like talking Dutch for like two hours. And now we're back switching to Engli English. We're back. Yeah, back from IGN. Yes, Diamond. Cool that you could watch as well. Yeah, it's actually very close, so that's why I'm able to... I, I, I don't have, like, a clone walking around or anything. So that's how I'm able to be at, in two spots. Uh, Soul's Gift, Light Bow, uh, Werewolf. Yeah, it's a decent set. I'm gonna give this a... 7. Because I think there are some cool items, but there's no, like, item that you really should get. We're gonna we're gonna showcase some of them before we jump into the Forgotten Saga. Um, I want to try Ooh, that much. trophy where you have to defeat the dragon without taking any shrines. Yeah. I want to try that. So that's kind of the the goal. Um, we're gonna change this for the werewolf head. I like start the recording as well. There we go. I think it's always a great armor uh, or like head was like the unique piece from from that. So we have that souls sort of bow as well. It actually works quite well with this arm, surprisingly well. This actually looks pretty dope. So you can get this head now for 120 opal. Phoenix is cool. Also a repeat. Okay, thanks for noting, uh, Linus. Um, uh, what, 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 what else was there? I'm not gonna like showcase these are not that interesting. So the soul's gift. I'm all go. Uh, light bow. What what the heck is this? Does anyone know? Blood elf sent this out. Okay, thanks, Gutao. Thanks for noting that. Let's say hey, Sharip. Thanks for joining for the first time. 
The Loki set, says Joyce. I have a blank spot. I don't even know. How you doing? Just so you know, you can buy the elk antlers from the shop. It doesn't afford... Oh, why? Nice, Eric. So I'm gonna try that. Hey, Vivek. Good to see you. Let's start the run for today. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna start. But they have released the... Oh, no! Jubisoft. Why? Why do you always do that to me? So, yeah. The Blood uh, Elf pack is out. Which is the least exciting one. I wanted either Iron Man or uh, Thanos. But they are releasing the blood one. Like, I really think... Like, call me a conspiracy theorist. But I'm gonna say it. Like, why... If you just launched what seems to be the biggest free drop for Valhalla this year. And you're not launching some of your most exciting freaking uh, uh, armor sets. Nothing That's more. so weird. And um, with pay... Uh, we will be back, Unibear. We will be back. Where is it? I think this one is all. I think it's a really cool horse. Like, for a horse, it's really cool. Take care. So, yeah, we have the... I was trying to do two things at the same time. So, we have the, the Phoenix Mount. Red Eye right now. Decent. Not bad. Not bad. I'm not gonna, like, I don't know, great or something. But it's not bad. And we have the, uh, the Horsey Warsey. Yeah. One of the coolest... I think coolest horses in a discrete period. But yeah, it's like launch material. It's like a year and a half old. So, uh, 150 Opal. That That is the one that is for sale right now, right? Not that I'm like showcasing a different one. I think this one is it. High Elf. Oh, the High Elf. Ah, that one. I, I still, correct me if I'm wrong, chat, but I still don't think that the helmet from the high elf this is really one of those sets where th this is like one of the sets where there are like too many sets like at long like when they when they released it was like we were really paying attention at one point it was like another reskin with a cool helmet to be fair though this helmet is awesome it doesn't fit this armor set at all let's go back to the werewolf but uh like i wish i i let me know, and again, maybe Red has sold it when I was not paying attention, but I, I don't, I have not seen it myself. At least not during these weekly reset streams, unless it was like during one that Dennis streamed. Um, and of course, this mount is, I think, at Red as well. No, okay. People are saying no, we, we did not have it. So yeah, that's the one that I'm just showcasing. We got the, the, the bird down. Again, the helmet is the highlight. This freaking... Soul's Gift, eh, don't, yeah, I don't think it's worth it. Um, what is the range damage, though? Because do I do like the fact that you have to keep moving. And, but it, I, I don't know what, like, the amount is. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm showcasing the wrong bow now. Soul's Gift. Ah, that's not, not good at all. Nah. But it is kind of cool that you always have it active when you keep moving. Like... Here, the moment I move, you see the perk. <gasps> if you like, focus on the on the perk right now. <laughs> Feels like something is broken, but it, uh... <laughs> okay, so you can do this if you want. Which is kind of nice, but apart from that, I would say uh, skip it. Okay, we're going to the Forgotten Saga. No. Uh, Red and never sold it. Okay, thanks everyone for noting. You're getting the AC whiskey, what? I think I, I saw it, but... I mean... I would be happy to, uh, to take a sip uh, on stream. But I don't think I will buy it myself. Any tips on how to get to hell? Because it's, it is difficult. Nadal, there is a very, very... Oh, we're at the wrong... Uh, sorry. That's kind of sad. I feel for Falka that we're now, like, not going to her uh, <laughs> hut anymore. Maybe she's happy about that. Eve, we're always drinking poisons. Potions. <laughs> now we're going to the craftsman. Where are you at? I think I have to get off my mount because he will, like, start walking very, very slow at one point. Because of the festival. Oh, actually. 
Oh, that's okay. Maybe it's only the uni bear. This mount is like, I don't care about the festival. Okay, let's um, go back. I cannot get the dead your armor. It doesn't appear. Is it like a bug? You can get it from this fender. It should be there. Uh, the chest piece is something you get when leaving the the the, the DLC. How many hours, Gaspar? 450 or more. Took me three hours, Anthony, for the first full Forgotten Saga. <laughs> I want to see a recording or it didn't happen. I do wish that I could, like, I don't know. If I knew about the flaming versus the dragon, I still think it would have taken me two times. Because the, the moment I, I, I defeated the dragon, it was uh, over. Um, okay, so I still have some uh, memories to uh, to get uh, to uh, exchange for some skills. I'm gonna buy my um, my my old weapon first. So there is a, a trophy where you have to defeat the dragon without any elk, shrine, uh, elk shrines. Um, so we just have to skip them, and I have to like really pay attention to that. Otherwise, I might like. Now we're gonna get this one. And recover one of the abilities. <laughs> okay, so preparation is half the work, as they say. So uh, we're already pretty well prepared. Let's get some skills down because I actually got quite a lot to, get, to give still. I don't think I need backpack. I think I'm gonna like work on the, the coins recovered. I think that in the end is actually very, very nice. Uh, we got it over here. Was oh, also fire, res fire resistance. Ah, uh, no. Poison against the dragon. Meh. What is this? Parry damage. Mm. Breakfall. Yeah, I, 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 I want to just jump around, not care about things. We and you can, by the way, reset these skills as well, which is actually kind of nice. So, like, I don't need this. So, I like do it like this. We still have some stuff here, which like crit chance, huh? stun, meh, health, yeah, health is nice. Especially, of course, because I do get health back with this armor set, but... And ranged resistance, some extra health. I think we're all already kind of good. 40 headshot damage is actually really good. Both the melee link, what's this? Emergency aim. It's actually kind of good, but I, I don't have the... So, we're gonna do it like this. Let's see if we can kill the dragon without an elk shrine. So, I think we have to skip some things as well. If I was Ubisoft, I would launch the Helix set at the uh, AC15 celebration. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But if there's no Valhalla update or no content, like the, f the, the Tombs of the Fallen are, of course, coming, it just like. I feel, find it just very interesting that they, they decide to. Um, Lightning Fury. Okay. That they decide to, to launch this stuff. Let me, by the way, check if my audio is good. Not that I'm like too loud. Oh, that's nice. When a lot of people are playing the game, like, personally, I think this means that they are expecting that we what might actually, that there, oh, that there is something great. bigger even. Did you, by the way, already encounter this? So if you have the favor where you revive, I have reclaimed my name. you I'm can actually uh, see you're here. You grow stronger then? Hey, Dennis, Sargon Shop, Odysseus Hood, Celestial Leg. Not bad. And I will do so here. They Arrows changed Sargon Reset. First time. Here if you haven't noticed. Oh, you have to are they changing it? The Blood of Pack is here. I heard about it. Yeah. We're gonna give you three arrows. I can spare a few. In return, I will fight by your side here. I think she will then just shoot like three, but show me what you got. I do have extra headshot damage, so that should actually help me quite a lot. And of course when this weapon crits. Oh! Ah I that's not smart. I, I cannot get help back from that either. Okay, 
Yeah, but I can get health back. Yeah. What? Or did I not upgrade this armor yet? Ah, damn. I think I... I because I'm like changing saves. Ah, okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, I can't. And if I like, then I. Oh no, no, I, I can still. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna re because I, I made a mistake. Do you love JV videos? For sure. I forgot to upgrade this armor set where I have to heal. Like, I already did it on a separate save. But I wanted to, uh, for this save, get my uh, get my weapons. Did not have the legendary sword. Either way, we're gonna go back. This will be fast. Any update on New Game Plus? Hopefully a September release. No, I think it's gonna be later than that. Oh, but now I cannot get my uh, my weapon. Okay, we're go we're gonna just get the the sword. That I I'm sure I can get the incendiary powder trap from my uh, f from like finding it. Uh, we want to upgrade this. Yeah, this is important. This is important. Okay, it did cost me my incendiary powder trap. Still, we need new game plus. I'm I'm with you. I'm personally hoping that they're doing like a uh, reset, uh, like um. Oh, she's still there. That's kind of cool. I think you can like do that now every time, but I'm not sure. We're just gonna do it ourselves. Health upgrade. That will be nice. Um. But like, I personally hope that we can just select a story arc. I would personally love that, because I I don't want to like. I don't want to play. I, I want more control over what what. Uh, here now, I'm getting my health back. Kind of or do I have to kill this guy? Yeah. Whoa! Like there are some story arcs, like the London arc or something, that I w would love to play again. But there are not like. I'm not sure if I really want to do the trick and treat again or something with with Gunner. Okay, we're going to get a rune over there. Or a weapon. Oh, we're going to get a rune. Pro tip, you can buy health at Fender. Still get the trophy. Thanks. Uh, yeah, people already said that. Thank you. I w so that's kind of the cheat. I'm totally going to do that. Or... Me Let's for the stream not try and do that because I already have the Niflheim armor, so I'm already cheating a bit. The dwarf and defender, of course, what it's called here. Like I want to try without that cheat, but if we're like standing in front of the dragon and I have like no health left, then we can do it. So let's let's make it a bit more challenging because I already have some healing. So. And I, of course, already have quite a lot of skills unlocked, so... Range... Uh, bonuses remove when receiving damage. That's actually not bad. So my theory, by the way, is... And, uh... Okay, we got an ability over there, so we're gonna go there, I think. Can we, like, do both? Sometimes you can. I think if I go there, I can, like, go that way. So, we're gonna go this way. But I, I would not be surprised if the runes and sort of new perks that they added with this DLC will be coming to the game as well. This is, like, the, the path. Because I think if I, like, go there, I can still go this way. Or is it, like... Is it, like, different? I think I can still do it. We're gonna do it. Because, yeah, they created quite a lot of stuff. Even, like, new versions of certain abilities. So, would be cool if they added them as, as like, runes. 
It is a gamble, but you can use a drink. Uh, others have special shops, center cups, works, works for me every time. Yeah, I, I did some research on the drinks. And I first thought that you could maybe look at the... Poison, okay. Health is high, hit, increase attack. Uh, of course, always go for the elemental, so we're going for that. And having the resistance against the dragon will be nice. We already have this one, by the way, which is great. Um, but yeah, I think it, it's really just random. It's really just like you have you have 66% chance that the drink that you're drinking does not hurt you. And it can, like, really hurt you. It, 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 I, I never had it myself, but I looked it up on YouTube. And it, like, I think it, like, kills you, like, pretty significantly. See, we got both, so that's great. We got both the ability and the rune. Nice. So, yeah. The, yeah, you can drink the... So, yeah, you can try and drink that. But, of course, if you pick the wrong one, we're just gonna... We're just gonna try and, and see how far we... If I'm able to be... Oh, only the bosses will be, I think, challenging. Okay, so we should not take those. But let's see if I can, like, do it without buying them in the shop. If if I'm unable, like, if I only have, like, a few... Poison arrow. Hey, we, we have the poison increases, so let's go for the poison arrow. Um, if I really see, like, I'm like I'm 60 health or something, and then we're, we're trying to... Uh, hey, come here. Wow, I totally wasted that gem. Then I can always buy it at the shop. We at least want to get the achievement in this stream. And I want to kill Hell as well. So that's kind of the, the, the challenge. Getting my very, very limited arrows back, which is great. I've only had the bad one twice. The first only took 5 health off, and the second one took damage over time, like 3 seconds or something. Yeah, it's pretty scary. It's really scary. So I'm like, nah, no thanks. We're gonna skip the drink. I think there's actually one close by. Uh, ability is actually, I think, smarter. Yeah. I wanna get that incendiary powder trap. The more chance, the better. Is there any cheat on the dragon? Uh, Nadal, yeah, it's fire. Fire. Burn it down. That's what you want to do. So make sure that you use the uh, incendiary powder trap. If you are able to upgrade it, totally do so. Because then it will have a second explosion, which basically deals more damage. And get runes that increase that fire damage. That's kind of how you want to do it. Let's get it. Okay, Eric. Whoopoo. Whoopoo. Oh, that was no whoopoo. Yeah, we already have the fire sword, so at least our melee attacks will deal quite a lot. Maybe I should have gone for the crit chance in the skills, but I think you can only get like a few crit chance. That's not even like 10%. Maybe like 10% in total, so it's not really that good. Oh, no. But yeah, thanks to the Dwarf and Defender armor, if I just hit this guy, I get all my health back, which is great. Where are you at? The only ranged enemies will be annoying. There it is! Okay! Ha ha! Ha ha! Okay. It's looking well already. We're only in the first region though, but still, it's looking good. Um... I saw Skata, by the way, drop a uh, a speed run. That will be fun to do as well, a speed run for this mode. I think he had like 44 minutes. That's pretty wild. That's really wild. I think he just ran through this first area, uh, like skipping everything, which I think totally the way to go. If you want to speed run, and then only look at the shop. So yeah, maybe one day. Right now, I want to get the trophy. And then I think next week we're going to try the, the Draugr uh, trophy. So that I have to kill the, the hell with the, the... Or next week? I don't know. Ne uh, maybe next week. We will see. Maybe I will stream this week like in general. And we try that. Crappy stuff. 
But yeah, you have to use the, the Draugr set. I think it like increases your damage taken or something. Do you think they will do a reveal trailer of the final chapter at the AC15 event? I really, like they might tease it, but I really don't think we will see like a lot of um, stuff about it. Can I go to this area? Or is that like over? I don't think I can, right? Because I think it will actually be a pretty short mission. So any spoilers or something would already reveal quite a lot. But uh, yeah, we will see. Maybe it like a tease. I totally think like Valhalla will be at the SS Creed 15 defense. And it's pretty wild. It's like in three weeks. Let me check. One, two, three. It's in three weeks, it's August 30th. So, I've, so in four weeks, it will be September already. We know, of course, Ubisoft has their four week event. Oh, right, I'm just getting memories. Um, hello, this is a big guy. Big guy. Let me hit you for my health back. Thank you. Let's get some uh, poison arrows so we're ready because he doesn't like that. Instantly poisoned. Taking a ton of damage over time, which is great. You're gonna die in one, in one hit. Okay, I need to hit this person fast or get health back over time. Whoa. But yeah, I think in like four weeks, five weeks, the, the event will be. Which still sounds pretty far away, but yeah, time flies, so. I think we will be there before you know it. And I'm sure they will like tease it a bit. I will probably do like a, an extra video to kind of revisit the, uh, the rumors and kind of what we think. Maybe there will be more things. One of my runs, hell never went into a second phase, so I just had to let it, oh, that sucks. And yeah, that sucks in a mode like this if there are bugs. I think overall, like personally, I haven't, I haven't like encountered them. But I really like if something goes wrong. Okay, we can already do it. Yeah, there we go. If something goes wrong, I can't like buy this. We we know that. But I'm I'm doing pretty well, so we're gonna save the money. You have to do the whole run again, of course, if something goes wrong. And we had quite a few bugs, of course, especially at launch. The festivals have been, I think, the worst in terms of bugs. Um, but I think overall they, they polish this up quite well. But yes, of course, for, things can still happen. Why have you returned, old oh, whoa, that is soon. Yeah, I mean, in September. September 10th is the Ubisoft 4th. I still think it's going to happen like on that Monday after that. Or like a few days after that. Okay, let's do it a, a second time. So we have the thunder effect on the wolf. Ah, and when he takes damage over time, he's doing his uh, state where we cannot hit him. That sucks. Oh. We really like Brush with Death. It's like a game changer in this mode as well. Giving you so much time to react. The fire is like doing a lot, and I don't even have the runes yet. And we're full health again. Woo -hoo -hoo. It's Barry. Oh, 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 fireworks. Yeah, I get health back over time if I don't get hit now. Oh, actually a lot of fireworks. The amount of attacks for these creatures is quite insane. Oh, we have the fire sword. Let's just keep hitting it. Should be down right about now. Nice, four health. Oh no, I, I think I started with 171. So I think we did not lose any health. That's great, okay, let's keep going. It will only get uh, harder from here. Have you ever got a Mjolnir in your Forgotten Saga run? Assassin Puffer Fish asks. I saw it, but I did not have the gems to buy it. So I, I, do, I don't have it. I saw Skata do the speed run with the Mjolnir, which makes sense. That's of course a very OP weapon. I see a lot of people say Gun Gungnir is pretty nice too. Like I, oh, I almost, oh, it's a habit. I, I did not take it. I did not take it. But uh, I think actually going for the half where we set, 
I think that's the one, right? Where you can dual wield two-handed uh, two weapons. Having dual spear might actually be the fastest way to clear this. Maybe I'm... If Scott is watching this, giving him a lot of ideas. <laughs> Fighting glitch in the festival games keeps crashing. I really hope Ubisoft is like gonna talk about that because I've seen like a lot of people say that the festival crashed on them. Which really sucked of, sucks of course to hear. And it's like something that happened like countless of times. I, I've maybe even like last year with the same festival. So that kind of sucks. Oh, my friend dies. What's going on? Uh -huh. Okay, we got the uh, health upgrade already. Ooh, they put the shrine there, so I maybe am I going to take it. No, 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 I won't. I won't. I really think that extra headshot damage is helping me a lot. Although, maybe I already killed all these enemies in one shot. I don't remember, but it's really, really good. Because you don't even need the Black Raven for this. Oh no, we have one big boy though. There's like one. Oh, I totally missed you. Well, I hope you die from the damage over time. I have fire on my blade and now you will die. Oh. I have parry damage now too, so my parries deal damage, which is kind of nice. Uh, we're going for the coins. I don't need any of that. How do you heal? Haha, <laughs> with this uh, armor. It's the only armor that heals. It has both grit and it has the Edun's heart. As you see right here, the, the two uh, bottom, uh, bottom upgrades, the, the final two. Um, so with grit, you when uh, the enemy deals damage to you, if you hit them in a short window, so the same enemy that just dealt damage to you, then we, oh, no, we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. We're fine. Four health. We lost. So. Of course, the, tr the, the, the true challenge would be to get this trophy without this outfit. It would have been, for sure. Not in the thing. We're already pretty far now. And uh, Eden's Heart, of course, gives you health regen. Which is still kind of crazy that they added, like, period, I think. Because the whole idea in Valhalla was always that you would use food and collect that. Uh, because you were, like, in foreign lands. That was kind of the idea, at least. What they said before launch. Because in Odyssey, we had a heal. And in Origins, you had like a lot of health on hit weapons. So it was pretty easy to get health back as well. They did not do any of that in Valhalla. Uh, I think maybe this might be nice. Are we going for the Adrenaline? But yeah, then they added the Edun's Heart skill, which is basically still a regen. Show us the map. This is where we want to go, of course, in the end here. <laughs> Go to War Eden's Apple. <laughs> I got the steampunk bow in the first box on my first run. Nice. Yeah, that's a decent bow. Let's see if we can like assassinate this person or at least get some health. And then it's already almost dead. I don't really need the coins. Like, usually I would say kill all the other enemies. Uh, unless, like, where are they, though? There's, like, one. There are, like, two. If I do my, my ability, I, I will hit them both. But that's still worth the, the money that I'm getting. Oh, actually, some gems. Nice. It's, like, still an enemy up there. Yeah, we're gonna kill him. I still need that trophy as well, where you have to kick 10 people off ledges. But I don't have to kick off tier right now. was going to ask if you like Mjolnir and another weapon. Two spears for this, weapon of choice, if you could. 
Yeah, I, I still need to try it. I, I want to like really because uh, I think the the armor sets really change your gameplay up. Like of course the armor set, the Hell's Damnation set that you unlock. It's called Hell. I, I know the original names. I don't know the names in the DLC uh, off the top of my head. But um, like that one is all about the summoning of these sort of companions. So, I want to try that playstyle as well. I think that could be kind of cool as well, to have like an army. Although, I'm not sure if you can summon creatures or like these 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 Draugr type things in a boss fight. Curious about that. But, uh, yeah, I, I do think that weapon upgrades and a room. Oh, there's a thief. Goodbye. Extra money. Thanks, Eivor. I totally would have missed it. New rune. Hopefully some fire damage. That would be great. Please. Crit chance after each hit. Earn more memories. I'm gonna go for crit chance after each hit. Because this weapon, of course, uh, has fire on it. So that's actually kind of nice. I want to have extra shock damage as well, though. But this already... Uh, oh, wow. Blocked. Yeah, I think I, I will see the, the fire a bit faster now. Wow, everyone died already. Yeah, the X-Fury is insane. Let's get a weapon upgrade. Yor, have you seen the, the Blood Elf pack is out? Yeah, I will probably... Because I had some issues with the store... Can you, like, check the store right now? Oh, there it is. The Blood Elf pack. This is the least exciting one. Again, Thanos is coming. Iron Man is coming. What the heck? Why is it loading? Foxy, of course. We saw the Fox already in the Shinobi set. But that one had, like, multiple tills. This one only has one. We have another, like, the, the Phoenix Mount is at Reda right now. I would argue that it basically looks the same. But it, it's really about this sort of headgear. It, it would have been cool as, like, a year one armor set, I think. As, like, a year one helix pack, then I would be like, oh, this actually looks kind of cool. But now I'm like, we know there are way better ones coming. So, critical damage when near fire. That's not even good. And what's the, the scythe? Killing ignited enemies make your next 5 hit deal critical damage. That's actually really good. That's actually really OP. Okay, so this could be fun to try out at least. But The images are always pretty cool. But yeah. I would argue that if you... Want a helix set? I would wait. And again, why why not release it now? Something is suspicious. Hopefully I can get like a legendary weapon from this. Otherwise we might pay a vi have to pay a visit to the gem store. Hello. Warcraft vibes. Oh yeah. Illidan, right? They're really like they. Oh wow! Give me my health back, please. Ah, I'm full health again. Boom! I'm always scared that that bomb hits me. Oh, I can't like throw these freaking axes back. Oh, there's like another enemy. It's like what the heck? Goodbye. And are you gonna die? Yeah. More coins. I think I'm gonna like just get the weapon and be out of here. Hard pass at Jonathan, yeah. Definitely not worth the 20 bucks, no. I agree. Although, like, I gotta say, like, I am, I, I am like, I don't mind like paying for like a helix, for an upcoming helix set or something because uh, this is free, like. This Forgotten Saga game mode, like, it, it exceeded my, my expectation. I think this is the best sort of thing they, they released for Valhalla. So, like, 
I would not buy mine to like uh, pay a bit extra to um, get something cool and uh, yeah support support the devs in that way or the devs they they don't get my money but of course you're sending a message I, I guess where did I why did they remove the tunnel spec it never released so the tunnel spec is like interesting it kind of reminds me of the lawgiver set uh, not lawgiver who remembers the lawgiver set from Odyssey that's a deep cut but the problem there was also a armor set that was leaked and so they never officially announced it and it was also not that great like cool or something it was also like one of the final elix sets they did in in odyssey yeah and it was all it, it leaked already I think by Jonathan, uh, the French YouTuber. And then, like, I think it was, like, not even kidding. I think, like, half a year went by and the pack was nowhere to be seen. And Ubisoft did acknowledge it. They were, like, at one point, because everyone was asking, like, where is this pack that you, like, that, that is already in the game files? It was, like, there six months ago. And they were, like, yeah, we had to change something or we had to improve it or something but then when it finally released again six months later oh, i have to be a bit faster here. turned out that they did not change anything so it was really weird why they moved it seems like they've forgotten about it which of course i don't think is happening is the, is the case. but uh yeah that was really weird and maybe the tail spec will be like that but i Again, yeah, maybe with the... Because the, the sort of interesting thing is every update they add one pack and one weapon pack. Sometimes two weapon packs and one item pack or two item packs and one weapon pack. And then they launched them a few weeks later. And now we had a couple of uh, item packs. Because the weapon packs do release while the item packs they're holding. So... Uh, and now, because the tunnel spec was leaked way before, like, I would say a month, two months, a month and a half, before the Blood Elf pack. And now the Blood Elf pack is out, and the tunnel spec not. Which is weird. Warby Gaming, yes, it is out. Warcraft vibes. I always get Helix weapons, don't care too much for the armor sets, Antonio Epps. Yeah, they, they have been doing great with the weapons. I, I especially love the uh, the light bow still with like the raining down fire stuff. That is still one of my favorite helix weapons. But I think overall they've been doing great with the heli with the red eye shop as well. I do wish though that at one point, like I think it's too late already right now. But it's nice that there are like in year two way more ways to get opal now through the festival. Like there is like a quite a lot of extra opal. Of course, Ubisoft Connect gave away some free Opal. So that's all great. But I really hope that if they bring a system like this back, which I hope they owe for, for, for one do, that they really look at the dailies and stuff. Like, how, how do you earn it? And make that more exciting. Because I felt... I, I thought the Odyssey dailies were at least... And weeklies, obviously. Weeklies were great with the weekly target and stuff. Was way better than in Valhalla. This this shield does show up quite often. Uh, okay, this is actually quite good at uh, at this fender. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get both. Gonna get both, I think. It's it's already like better than the weapon I have now. I don't need the fire arrows. I think I, I will just use the incendiary powder trap, and this rune. Rune is not great. Rune is not great, but I'm at least gonna get the weapon, the shield, because I think I'm gonna rock this this sword like anyways, and I, I I'm gonna get this one as well. Let's do it, because I I'm using that uh, thunder uh, ability quite often. Just bought the elf. Let me know about the scythe. I'm curious about the scythe, uh, Warby Gaming. The scythe looks very good. Gay Bollock. yeah. It gave all like not a helix weapon. Not sure if you're talking about that. Oh, who won the giveaway? Whoa! We're gonna select that life 
Okay, I... I was at the IGM podcast. I just got hope like 10 minutes. But that's totally right. The giveaway ended. We're gonna select a winner right now. Oh, is it already selected? Wait a second. But thanks for noting. Skata, hello. What was your... Uh, what was your... Uh, your... Um, Winner, draw winner. What was your uh, what, your time again for the the, the speed run? Because I want to try it as well. Not not today, but uh, okay. I have to like change it up a bit. Give me one second while I like. I, it's harder now. Uh, I'm gonna like put the name in the chat. Penny Royal Juice won. But if I'm like showcase this screen, you will see the 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 uh, the email address, which uh, is not. Uh, oh, maybe I can do it like this. If I like window capture. Uh, this. Oh, it's already too late. Oh, I did not thought that. Either way, I'm gonna. Put it in the chat. I'm gonna... Uh, 33 minutes. That's insane. So that's the winner. I will uh, reach out. And I will start a new giveaway. I think uh, around like when when we know about a new update for Valhalla. Blood of Pack reminds me of Odyssey for some re reasons. Aiming for less than 30. Okay, that will be a hard time for me to beat. Like, I'm, I'm chucking along right now. Like, I'm not in a hurry right now. But, uh... Whoopie doopoo. Also, second boss. Yeet it. What? Can you, like, pu push that... That boss in the lava or something? Uh, instant poison. Really good. And... That. I ha I really wish they would like turn off this animation. It really like takes the the speed out of this mode. But it's like super specific. Okay, let's kill this one. Congrats, Penny. Yeah, I'm not sure if Penny is watching, but I will uh, reach out via the uh, input at Raptor.com email address and then start a new one for 2,300 healers credits. Quite a lot of people actually. Uh, Participated. This was like N3 2000. Of course, I think there are like a few hundred people. So if you win one of these, you're like super lucky. Four health on the heavy finisher. I think this might be nice, but I'm gonna go. No, I'm gonna go for this. Like having the health. We. I think I'm gonna manage with the dwarf and defender armor. We can get some. Uh, some. Uh, Health upgrades right there as well. Let's do it. And then we're ready for the second boss. And then we're making our way to the dragon. And let's see if we can kill that dragon. So far, so good. But it's, of course, going to get worse in the druid area. I'm going to skip the werewolf, I think. I'm going to skip the werewolf. Such a great ability. Especially if you have like shock uh, upgrades. Now I don't have it, so the enemies are not like instantly shocked. While they shoot, while they normally like would be. Alright, fire arrows. Okay, I'm gonna hit you because you are dealing damage. Pack Thanos, yeah, still not out. They did release another pack. Uh, Squalerio, and of course when I look up at a name, and I totally butchered the name as well. I'm sorry. Sorry. Okay, I'm I lost some health there. But sometimes I'm getting health back out of nowhere, so let's hope that happens again. I think I'm just like regenerating more health than I'm actually like, which kind of way up. Oh. Blood Drunk is so nice, especially when starting runs. Also, the... Oh yeah, five, f 
the rune that gives you 5 plus 5 health per rune. Yeah, that's pretty good. I had that, I think, during my the, the rune, uh, the run that, that, that did complete my, uh, my thing. Let's see, we can get some memories. Let's do it. I really enjoyed the Forgotten Saga. I just felt sure. I don't know. Like, the idea is, of course, that you do it more even after beating it. Um, I think it was, like, a good size, especially for... Like, I prefer, I prefer this size that every sort of realm is, is very interesting and uh, has, like, different enemies than, than if they would, like, add six realms. Like, also, if you make it longer, then it will only suck more that you have to do it again. I think this is the good size. Like, I'm taking my time, but you can, like, Escata is, like, he had 33 minutes to complete this. That's kind of crazy. That's really crazy. But I do think Skata and not to, like, it's still, like, really good. Oh, yeah. I mean, I would say, like, if you could not take, take weapons from your previous run, because I think you're using Mjolnir, right? That would, of course, be the true challenge. But then you're, then it's all about luck. And then, yeah, it's hard to kind of speedrun. So, yeah, I, I get it. That you have to get some weapons. Oh, what am I doing? Didn't didn't cost me any help, which is great. Let's uh, get out of here. Let's see where I need to go. It's over there. But, yeah, also, like, if they would do six realms, but they were, like, less exciting and they would rehash some enemies. Like, this made mo a lot of sense. We get Frost Giants. Um... At the start, we get the uh, the moose poles in the second one, the druids after that, the poise poke bomb. <laughs> no, we're not doing that because I'm not able to uh, do that. We can upgrade these abilities. What happens here? Ah, yeah. More damage. Please give me more damage. Weapon upgrade. So, yeah, I think the size is actually good. Done it on the third try with that armor set. Yeah, it's really good armor set. But yeah, I wanna like next stream, uh, or I'm not sure if it will be the next stream, but like I wanna try that trophy where you have to defeat hell with the Draugr set. Yeah, 33 minutes is the same, right? Uh, so, yeah. All weapons, good idea. I mean, you've said that countless of times. Okay, I want to get my health back. Okay, we're waiting on the... Oh, wow. That did hurt. Oh, but I immediately got my health back on that ability. That's nice. Let's see if this actually does. Shoot. And this armor set does. Oh my god! That uh, explosion out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, this armor set does deal. It, it's kind of cheap. Gonna, like, have one of them. Oh no! And for people who are just joining, I'm not using any elk shrines or buying them at the. Um, okay. They have to nerf the incendiary powder trap. <laughs> It even works on this guy. He's a freaking molten uh, lava guy. Fire damage. OP. <laughs> but yeah, they... Uh, what, did, what was I saying before that? I don't know. I will so... Stream after that speed run. I, I don't know. I want to try it though. But I, I think I have to... I, I, I want to do it. But of course, we have Saints Row in two weeks. So... Um, I will be very occupied with that. Any tips for the base game? Oh, sorry, Robert. I just saw your comment. Um, my tips for the base game would be... Oh, don't take it. Don't take it. Yeah, so we're not taking any Elk Shrines. There's a trophy for that. Uh, not buying them either. Um, tips for the base game. Yeah. Damn, that those video I made those videos a year and a half ago. I, I don't really 
like get the 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 stable upgrades is like the biggest like easy tip that you can easily forget but there are like mount upgrades and that you your mount can swim at the stable so totally get that um apart from that like i would give you a tip to just do the content that you're looking for that you want and maybe do some of the uh, the, the post launch content in between like at one point, you might get like a little burned out on the story because the missions take very long. So maybe go do something else. There's so much content right now if you just started playing with the mastery challenges, the Tombs of the Fallen. Do something like that. I think that is kind of the my, my, my tip overall. Oh, I kind of have to get some health back. Let, let's wait for this person to die. Oh, no, not no. Okay, we're... Oh. That hurts. Okay, I'm taking quite some damage here. But I'm gonna get it back, somehow. Okay, that I wasted quite a lot of health. We, we have like a... We have like a health upgrade here so that's kind of nice wait a second oh no i fall i was like my health did not upgrade but i did heal that was weird but that was uh <laughs> there was a short delay my favorite ac game xao uh ling i hope i pronounce your name right uh is origins like egypt is amazing especially now with 60 fps what is on the other side? Can ability. We're gonna go for the runes. Like, I need that extra fire damage. If I can get that, then the dragon will just burn down. And I think, like, that was, of course, the first game that introduced the RPG elements to the series. So, yeah, that makes it instantly more fresh. Everything was still fresh in that game. So, yeah, um, and I, I like the story the most. Or like the, the characters. And I was just never really engaged with the Egyptian mythology. So seeing that and then in that like very... Interactive way was just uh, super cool. I'm slowly getting health back I feel, but... Nice. I think we got it. Uh, ha, 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 ha. That's weird. That's weird. Because then I have fire and poison. Why not? Let's try that. Not sleeping again. Hey, Andy. Hey. How, what, what time is it? In your... Because last time, for people who don't know, Andy... Uh, I was like... I was like streaming way later, though. So it was like 5 a.m. when you when you stopped. Will the result be any different? Oh no, I'm not gonna take those drinks. Uh, we want another. Like, there's a weapon. We can like try it. But I have to make sure that I'm not losing like a lot of health. I okay. Can I like get there? Okay. I just uh, wish they would add DLC for Origins, best AC game for sure. Like. There were, like, uh, there were still, like, oh, no, this is the werewolf area. I said I would not do it, but now I can't go back. What the heck? Oh, you must block that is hot. Placement of the stones has activated the power. It's that what struck the throne down. Wake up! Hello? First time I'm seeing this. Is there like another sort of stone here? Okay, not sure if, uh, if that's something, but... Hey, Terrace. Thanks for joining. Uh, Predator Bow. No. But yeah, I'm gonna fight the freaking ah! 
Always that jump. Okay. Huh? Why can I not hit the werewolf? The werewolf. Okay, I need I need a uh, someone to help me out. What the heck this This werewolf is also looking kind of crazy and different. Oh, what? Maybe because I like killed this werewolf a couple of times. It's kind of similar to that uh Do I get like a favor for this? Werewolf. Oh, huh? Oh, I need to go through these stones. What the heck? Is that it? Power protects this creature. Okay, another one. Oh. Now some roots show up. I don't need an elk shrine, but I, I appreciate this. I won't let them hurt oh, it's part of a trophy. Awesome. Sister will recover once I move her away from the That's cool. I, I did not do this before, so. I, I, I like these extra secrets. No, they weaken us. Why are people suddenly I'm asking about Mortal rules, Kombat? So and in like 10 <laughs> She may be confused. I understand. I'm heartened that family bonds could survive such a place. But I will be glad I've not I have played Mortal Kombat, but not please stop spamming, otherwise I will give you a timeout. What the heck? Who won the, the giveaway? For the rebirth that will be Ragnarok. You have my thanks and my pledge. It was Penny Royal Juice. Hurt, uh we'll Shay Guy. Nice. And we got a, a new favor. So you have to, I think, kill the werewolf three times or something? Comes to your aid when you get... Oh, wow. That's awesome. So many cool uh, little things here. Okay. I was really paying attention that the uh, that the werewolf like, was like part of sort of mission. So that's cool. But yeah, it did cost me some health. Uh, memories. We're gonna get these, I guess. Or can, like, skip them because I don't, like, really need them. I'm gonna get the ability, though. But I probably can't reach it, or can I? No, I probably need to use the teleporter. Oh, no. We can use the bridge here. Thanks, Joyce. Yeah, it's uh, it was over here. This is the werewolf spot, I think. Hey Marcus, good to see you. Oh, we're already doing that. Okay. Yeah, doing well. I I I went to uh IGM Benelux earlier today I participated in their podcast which was in Dutch so that was uh, kind of fun to uh, talk, talk in Dutch I do like that my parries like stagger enemies, that's kinda nice, nice. Oh wow, I have fire and poison now. Oh wow, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, that's for you. I got one for you as well. 
Uh, oh, I have no arrows left. Did you like? What? I think he killed himself. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I personally want to like upgrade this. I have three adrenaline slots, no arrows though, so that uh, doesn't really help. We can still, I think, get a health upgrade, and then it's dragon time. And let's see if we can uh, kill it without the. I'm fe I'm feeling good. I think we can manage. I second scout that the hammer is OP. Yeah, I still haven't used it in this mode yet, so. But uh, I want to. I totally want to. So I think we have to get go here get the get the stuff and then probably use the teleporter where where is that is that right there there's like another i don't think i can reach that anymore we're gonna see fire ports and should should be an explosion yeah yeah we will see we will see In Far Cry, you could do like fun uh, combos with that. Let's see if I can like have both triggers. Okay, I'm only doing poison damage, it seems, which is kind of sucky because I want the fire. Let's see if I can like get the fire. Because I see both effects, but I only saw the poison build up. Let's see. Oh, I want to get that health back, please. Uh, okay, now it's fire. Okay, so it's kind of roulette. <laughs> I get one thing and then the other. That's fine. Uh, sometimes I get nothing. Oh. Ah, uh, yeah, the wooden stick would be fun as like a weapon. Or maybe w what if like if you would drink or if there was like another random element where it was like a risk reward thing where you could either get the gay bollock or you could get the wooden stick. Like that it would like be like yeah, you can open this chest for the gay bollock, or I don't think the gay bollock is actually in this mode, or uh, or Mjolnir, or you can get the wooden stick, and then still beat the DLC with the wooden stick. That would be kind of cool. Okay, because I think it's totally possible. Like, of course, elemental is like really important, but the base damage, the values like that, don't really matter that much. I think that's where the teleporter is. So, uh, this is where we have to go. There's a gem fender close by. We might actually want to pay a visit or I'm gonna... I don't think I will need it for the dragon. I still have, like, more health than I had before, which is kind of crazy. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do it. Okay, let's go down. I don't want to like waste all my okay now I'm getting only fire so it's kind of like it depends I guess which kind of weird no I don't I want that health back please did I get more health back than, than I lost I want to try something and this may be very stupid but I want to like kill these enemies first okay let this enemy hit me like once if I, like, hit them now, I get my health back. Do I get more back? Yeah. I you get more back than they actually dealt to you. That's crazy. So let them hit me. Okay. And now I can hit you. And and I have more. I had 600, 262 or 1. And now I have 262. That's a pretty sick tactic to get some extra health back with this uh, Dwarf and Defender armor. Let's see where we have to go. Uh, it was like up here, right? Yeah. You missed the gem merchant. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Like, uh, uh, 
I want to, like, get it. Or, actually, I'm not sure if I still have that favor for... For Hell's Gem Fender. We will see. Is the Gem Fender not, like, over here? Can I, like, not still... Oh, no. I missed it. Yeah, it's not... Oh, wow. This is, like, the Gem Fender in another... Slightly different... I've transmogged all my swords to be the wooden stick crack. <laughs> That's awesome. I hope we get some of the abilities from this in the main game. I love the lightning axes. Same here. But it's of course the X Fury. But what but if they would like add it to the in the Dawn of Ragnarok DLC. Yeah, there are quite a lot of questions, sadly, D S James uh, games. D D S games. Yeah, I, I'm hearing quite a lot of crashes, so I hope that they will, like, fix that. Okay, we're gonna get this for sure. Oh. I do want to get this back. Oh, no. I'm taking a lot of damage. Getting some health back, too. But still, it's not great. Okay, let's, uh... <gasps> okay, I want to hit this guy. Oh wow, actually wasting a lot of health in this final moment here. Okay, getting some health back from that grid. I'm gonna get, let this guy attack me. And then get some health back that way. Oh. Come here. Dude. It's not that hard. Hit me please. Okay, and now it's my turn. Right. Let's at least get him on the ground. Can he, like, hit me once? I don't want, like, the fire bombs. I, I just want, like, a regular hit. Yeah. See, I got way more health back than I had before he hit me. Uh, but still, I'm not doing too hot. Not doing too hot. Uh, get some extra arrows. Um, it's right here, right here. Oh, there's still like a weapon upgrade. Can get some health back through that as well. Sekiro is good. Got luck with the final boss though, thanks Diamond. But like for the final boss I can take shrines again. Although there will not of course be a lot of shrines in hell. See, so you've been busy lo uh, since last playthrough. Keep up the good wor uh, work and thank you for the great content. Thanks, Matthias. Pr appreciate it. Ignore the fire and go all for health regen. Ah, that was a nice kick. Okay, let, let, oh, that's like an annoying one. Again. Oh, no. He's gonna die from that. But we uh, want to have, like, my adrenaline up. Yeah, I'm, I, I, I have more health now. So we're gonna... That's the tactic, to get some extra health back. Like, I, I, I can still buy it from the shop. But I, I just don't... Uh, I want to try it without. Oh, that was like a one-hit KO. That's great. These are like... Okay. Let's see if I can, like, hit you. Yes, more health. Thank you. Was that you? Ah, not getting the health back. Okay. 
More health, more health. It's not a lot, but uh, we did get more health. What set do you use in the Forgotten Saga? I'm using that Dwarven Defender set. Extra the block. That's great. It's fine. Okay. This is it. Should I buy at the merchant? Let me know in the chat. Yes or no. Because... I think I can manage. I think I can do it. I want to try. Without the... Uh, but it would be very stupid if, if we don't make it now. Uh, am I like... Oh, it's like already... I have to use the lift. Let's use the lift. Naruto says yes. Anthony says no, you can do it. Okay. So yes is buy. If, if he's selling, I, I think he's selling. Looking for a bit? I should buy? Otherwise I'm not gonna make it? Oh yeah, we got we got a cheat right there. That's what was Kata was talking about. My health just increased by quite a lot. Oh my god, this is amazing too. Don't buy. You can. Okay. I think people that that were saying yes probably meant that I should not do it. Let's uh get the health upgrade as well. I can get only one. You probably will be okay if you're level 3 in incendiary. Yeah, I think so. Keep playing it. Level up skills. Yeah, we're going. Okay, so I haven't bought or used a shrine. And we're going against the dragon. Let's do this. And Sir Sitzlot has a very good point. I have my revive. Which I totally forgot about. If you have summoned courage, don't worry about health. You're right, Eric. Let's do it. Let's grab, grab, grab a drink. Low times are longer, I, I feel, but probably not the case. Oh, yeah, there we go. Let's take a moment to appreciate the, the boss arena. Really, really cool. Oh, we got a fire blade as well. Boom. Oh, it's doing poison damage. Getting health back from hitting... Oh. Oh, he's already going down. Okay, let's uh, try and get close to him so he dodged this attack. Whoop oh, the damage. They really are going to nerf the incendiary powder trap. <laughs> I would love it, by the way, if they made a hardcore mode or like a harder difficulty in general, like for this. I would love that. Boom! Second one. Okay, that's only one. But it's enough. It's like one. Give me the fire. Give me the burning. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's doing the poison. 
Okay, don't use the poison rune when you... Uh... Yes, that was a nice hit. If you have, like, fire on your weapon already, because it will ruin the effect. Another one, boom. Okay, let's give him a few more hits here. There we go, and only one feet is still vulnerable. I have enough adrenaline for another one if he's, like, gonna drop down, which he is doing now. Okay, let's move to the side here. Try and dodge his attack. Oh, whoa, he changed that last minute. Okay. Okay, I could have used Focus of the Nornir for this next part, but still. Remember how hard the dragon was first run? Yeah, that, that, that's what, of course, is fun about roguelite modes. But I do feel that the, the incendiary powder trap with... Like, it's upgraded to level 3. But, like, it's a bit oh, too OP. Ah, uh, no. I can't outrun them. Wait. If you have focus of the Nornir for this part, that's nice. Okay, I only killed two. So you will get a ton of health back, I would imagine. Blast is only for good for one feet though right now in these uh, uh, second stages. Yeah, we got the fire again on the blade. That's great. One feet to go. Ah, uh, but you are like the first time I like. Or the second time as well. I, I did not use, like, the, the, the incendiary powder trap. And then you see, like, the amount of cool attacks this dragon has. And this fe really feels like kind of a cheat. We should have the, uh, the, yeah, pure of heart. We do have the achievements where you, of course, defeat Nidhogg without using an elk shrine. Well, we got that. Awesome. Too easy with the powder trap. Yeah, a bit too. I really think they're gonna at least change that. Or I think in the future we have to like... Agree that we are not gonna use the powder trap. You've gained health, says Eric. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That's kind of the crazy part with this armor. Okay, let's see. Because the other parts are gonna be actually harder. But I do have like my extra thing. Thanks everyone. Would be fun that poison attacks heals Nidda. Oh yeah. Like again, having a... I would be down if there was like a hard mode. Just like hard mode runs. Maybe even le less elk shrines. Um, less legendary weapons. I don't know how you're gonna make that fun. But uh, maybe not the legendary weapons. I do think it's fun if you can still have like a good legend... Or, or maybe legendary weapons like spawn more often. But just the enemies are just way harder. We can use the elk shrine now. Uh, to defeat hell. This is like the only one I can still get. So uh, let's get it. And, uh, it. Guess this will be the 8 hour. If it took last time. Oh yeah. For sure. Yeah Linus. If they do a hardcore mode. I would like to start like poison damage for double damage. Stack damage. Like fire and poison damage for double damage. I mean, of course, hardcore mode has to be harder. So, if they would increase stuff, I don't know if that would work. But yeah, giving the, the bosses more health would be awesome. I do think they're kind of... And I think that's good. Because if, if it was like more um, hardcore from the get-go, then I don't think a lot of people would have finished it. And I now think that everyone who's playing it, maybe at the first time you're like, oh, I'm getting my ass kicked. But I do think you will see progression and you will see the light at the end of the tunnel. But right now, like, it's really forgiving. If you get hit, you only take, like, a few damage, like 10 or something. And if, like, the hardcore mode would be like regular Valhalla, but then maybe on hard difficulty, that, that would already be way more interesting, I think. 
How did you get the same weapon as the last time you played, Andy? Um, in uh, the favor shop at the dwarf at the at the start of the DLC, you can buy a uh, a thing that gives you that. So you can like pick one of the weapons you had last time for like 75 uh, memories, which is very cheap, and then use that. Oh, we have to uh, get here. Okay, see how, will, how they will like this, because I, I I still need like my... I still need like my... Okay, we have one sellout enemy. But I, I still have this. Like I have some crazy increases for for shock, just not the damage yet. So if I am able to find like a rune that increases the damage, okay, we did lose some health there, but not a lot. It could be worse. What's in red? Hey, Warrior GS teams. I will uh, go back to uh, wake up, showcase the, the blood, health, uh, blood health pack re uh, real quick. Um, and what, what red has for sale. But in short, it has the, the, the wolf helm. I, I don't need to go here. I have break fall now, so please. Still, still. But I can, of course, get that back. So uh, That's that wolf helm from the werewolf pack, which was kind of cool. Um... I'm gonna go left. Last time I took right. I think right is actually still to the gem store, right? Did I like miss the gem store now? I hope not because I got like quite a lot of gems. Um, it has like the very cool Draugr mount that was a red a couple of times. It has a high elf light bow, which kind of boring, and it has the uh, Phoenix um, bird skin, which okay. Try and get Thor's hammer. Yeah, I'm hoping that I get it. I, I want to get uh, to the gem store, but I'm, I'm, I'm not sure if I like missed it already. I don't know. We are able to get like a an ability upgrade here. I think I'm going to go for the adrenaline. Uh. Having the shock to just like crowd control them is like amazing. Uh, where are all the enemies at? They're like on top. I'm gonna like f f chase them. I really think, especially this part of the realms, does like have a really cool or like a small Dark Souls type feel to it. Especially because you have to be way more careful here the enemies like because they're like based on sellouts and i think we i don't think we've ever seen this enemy like two ad gears i don't think we've ever seen them. so that so these enemies are like way more challenging ton of health as well as you can see there's like one headshot Yeah, this will put them in their place. They're not that stunned that easily. But I am able to really easily stack elemental bonuses. I want to just jump down, but I'm kind of scared that it will cost me some health. But I'm still doing it. Ah, okay, I'm getting that health back. Uh, what should I like? I think I'm going for the, the adrenaline. The rune was powerful. Awesome, I saved up quite a bit of oval. It, it's only just done. I've only just done the Odyssey crossover. Nice, what did you think? Can we like go through this? This doesn't look like the way I should go. Yeah, it's this way. I don't see no health la later. How do you win? On the later boss? Like you mean on the... Oh wow, we have a choice again. I think this one is like the gem store. I hope so.
Hey, can you give me tips on how to easily kill the dragon, Albert? Uh, see, we are at the gem store. Um, uh, incendiary powder trap upgraded. Ah, uh, we have this one again. Oh my god, this is the best ruin in the game. <laughs> in this mode. Yeah, I'm gonna get this one. This like what you want. This makes everything insane. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna get this one over the shield. Yeah, we're gonna do it. It's like a fully upgraded frost room. They did not change this, right? No, it's still like the, the same. That's pretty good. How many more trophies have you left for this DLC to complete? Imobius, thanks for uh, for joining there and uh, for your first chat. Um, I still need a few. I, I think I need the Draugr one. And like that you have to com use the Draugr outfit and then complete the Hell Boss. I think that might, might be it actually. So yeah, we will do that in the future. Should not be that that hard. Because we already completed the dragon without taking an elk shrine. And I would argue, I first thought the dragon was harder than hell. I think it's now kind of the opposite. Because, of course, now we have like a cheat for the dragon. It's kind of crazy to see fire and poison on these weapons at the same time. Nice. Let's get them together and use the X-Fury. <laughs> There's someone like standing there who out of nowhere gets a, a shocking X, which is nice. Boom, with an ice blast. Oh, what a combo. Okay. It's the first time I'm playing with this dwarf set and with the healing unlocked, and it really, really makes the mode way more manageable. Chain heavy hits to release a shock blast when fully charged. Okay, we're gonna chain some heavy hits for a shock blast. And then we have a fight. Oh my god, we have so much stuff that is like comboing. Uh, okay. Uh, I think we have to go here. You get one more health back after falling. You can heal yourself by jumping from a high edge. Oh my god. You may call me B. That's a very, very nice spot. This must be the secret soul of the air. Yeah, see you. I think I always spoke to this guy. Hey, there's a regular shop. That's great. I can buy like a... Killing a target cause the weakness and fear. Um, I never, never used this one. Never used it. Uh, lol. Oh yeah, the rest is already upgraded. I'm kind of like... I'm not so sure what I should get. I think I'm gonna get this. And that's it. Oh, wait, I'm gonna get. Uh, I hope I, I can still buy it. I think it's 300, right? <gasps> Ooh, okay. I'm gonna jump back into Rev of the Juice as I never finished it before I play Paris and Ragnarok. Very heartwarming at the end of the Odyssey crossover. Nice. Totally play the Odyssey content as well. I thought it was even better than what they did in Valhalla. Okay, we got some health. We got a health. What is the max? It's like 500 health max. Oh my god. With Look with that insane rune that I just got. Like, I don't even have to do anything. These enemies are already dead. With one ability. Oh. 
Is there like someone here? Oh, there. I need to kill these two as well. With three. I really kinda, kinda got the perfect loadout right now. Burning, thunder, you cannot do any ice blast. I want to see that shock blast as well, but uh, let's see if I can like do it on this guy. You can beat this blindfolded at this point. I'm not so sure about that, but yeah, it, like I. I I think it's like the armor. I should probably change armor uh, quite a lot. Uh, uh, oh, I think I should like probably go down here. Yeah. Is this like the final one? Or, like the is there like one? I think there's one more. I also like it in this realm how you have to do them. You cannot skip them. Highest I've have is 465. I think 500 is doable, yeah. Okay, we still have one for weapon upgrades. I don't need that, but again, I, I have to do this. Because otherwise I can't continue. Like it's up. Oh, actually, I. It seems like I can, but I don't think I can. So I'm gonna just uh, kill them. I think I'm just gonna go for the, the memories. Okay, let's see if I can like have the shock boss appear. Oh no. No, 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 no. Not on my watch. Where would I be without this? And okay, that that one will still be kind of cha ah, challenging. Is hard. Can still eat some of my health or not? Okay, we should be able to do this. Hell, here we come. I think I I beat her like. Uh, oh, we got, we're gonna use the lift. Whee! With like less health in a less OP run. Well, we will see. The drugger, the drugger outfit is the best. Is that the the? Yeah, I call it drugger. It's of course the. I, I, I can't remember the real name. The uh, it is the drugger set, right? Oh, there's still like an ability. Oh wow. Well. Uh, let's see if I can like do this. And I want to get some adrenaline for the hell fight, so I'm gonna like hit them as well. One enemy I can like. Probably get some adrenaline from. That's another bar, and they're dead. Oh, th there's like another one. Can I get my full heart bar by just hitting him? I will die from there. Yeah, I got all my health again. Oh wow, but again, I don't think you can actually use this in. Um, I don't think you can actually use this during the fight, so I'm curious. That would be great. Let's uh, kill hell. I did not drink the cups. Uh, Dragger stole. Okay, is the name of that outfit. You need to beat hell with in order to uh, get the trophy. I probably should have like just used that because the dragon was really easy. I think if I like had that outfit on, we could have like done both trophies in one go.
Caspian, I haven't tried full stealth yet because um, it, it's just not good against the bosses, and I, I really think the bosses are the hardest part. Realm, and you, of course, have these. Not until I see my son. Are you sure he wants to see you? <laughs> Uh, and of course, like, during the invoke, where you have to, like, uh, invoke at a statue, like, stealth is useless there. So I really think that overall stealth is kind of the, the weakest way to play. Uh, this dog is already gonna die from just a shark, I think. Oh, no. Oh. Because, see, I cannot, I cannot use the, uh... The, the sort of people to help me out. How do you like an incendiary pilot? Oh my god. Boom. Another one. Uh, it's kind of unfair. Dogo is already dead. Aww. Is he still taking damage? I don't think so. Oh, full health again. Okay, okay, I see what you did there. Brush with death also like a game changer first of all. <laughs> It's basically two abilities in one. It's really insane. And another one. I think it's pretty easy to get that trophy. Oh, whoa, I did not pay attention. Sometimes I forget that there's still like a... Oh. How are we gonna kill her? Uh... I wanna see some... Okay, that's a pretty cool combo. Let's kill her with uh, with the left hand attack of the flail. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Come on! Oh! No! Come on! Yeah! Whoa! Yeah! Yes! the same actions over, over and, and over, over regardless of their results yes determined <laughs> you cannot fight the land itself even now roots reach for you seeking to expel what does not belong I made this world I brought it into being and no one will bar me from any part of it you left behind a rotted stump. I nursed it into a dreadful orchard. the uh, second cutscene then insane or determined yeah see what you did Derek parry her to death ah I see that Theo I, I, I saw that one a little too late <laughs> I enjoy these updates for the difficulty and lack of no, oh, oh, they have to start this end game stuff. Okay. 
I've been in this eight times boring now, just like the river. I mean, eight times is quite a lot. You probably play this for 15 hours. For a free update, I would say that's pretty good. But I do hope they, like, add a reason for us to... Like, I'm not done with it, but I do feel that I completed it. Can I tip? Like, I, I, I understand it now. And the only real way to make it a bit more fun is to experiment and try different armor sets. But yeah, this one, where it's like... Um, uh, light your enemy... Light your melee weapon on fire temporarily after racing a Draugr. Like, you cannot do this during boss fights. So that's kind of sucky. Booby traps a dead body to damage anyone who investigates it. That's pretty... Yeah, that's actually very s bad. W why would you do that? Enemies who perish from one of your fire attacks will continue to burn. Dealing fire damage to near... That is actually really good. Yeah, the battlefield cremation. Intense rage. Oh, you, you can't see it because my, my, my sort of thing is over it. I can, like, upgrade this one, though. Yeah, it's kind of hard to read. Your race dragger will explode when killed or when expired. So you can like basically make sort of a dragger sort of build, which is kind of fun. Uh, this one is more fight with increasing fury as death draws near. Your damage increase the lower your health. Send it back right at them. Catch and throw. Press while sprint attack. Battle. Oh yeah, that's the. This one is like not that interesting at all, but you have to get it. Oh, and the healing effects are reduced. That's why it's like harder. You have to kill hell with this one. So I'm gonna like upgrade this one. Because, uh, yeah, we need to uh, get that for the trophy. But I actually am kind of... Like this, the, the stealth one. I might like do this one as well. Because you can dual wield heavy weapons. This will alter stats and handling of each weapon. Like... This is going to be fun to try out as well, I feel. Bash through breakable objects. Nice. Oh, you always get that ability. That's pretty cool. To do more damage on the next hit. When one or more adrenaline slot is filled, you gain a damage boost and attack speed boost. This effect augments with each slot filled. That's pretty good as well. So I think you can actually... I think this might actually be... A better speedrun build, uh, Skata, but I might be wrong about that. This one is also pretty good. So yeah, we'll be uh, trying that out, of course. Um, I'm gonna, like, spend some... I think at this point I'm, like, just gonna let the game g put my skill points in place. Boom. We're... we're f I'm fine with it. Um... I want to make sure that I don't... I, I think I'm good. Um, oh, never mind, by the way. Because I, I don't I did not buy the favors yet. But luckily, we can just reset skills and then... Which is actually kind of nice. See if I, like, say... Uh, I don't want my bow to melee link. I actually have my, my things back. I don't want the range damage. So I can still buy my favors. And now we're gonna go and check out, uh, show people that just joined what Reda has, real quick. And uh, what the blood, can I like buy the blood elf pack right now? That health gaining was mad though. Yeah, it was kind of OP. Uh, it, it's like really the, like that's why I also put it in the video. Like that's the best armor overall, because you cannot get health back through easier ways than that. But yeah, it will be fun to try different builds. I think Dual Spear will be a lot of fun. Because that's, of course, really powerful as well. So that should actually be maybe even better. Yeah, Tim, uh, or the rider. It's also in my recent video. If you look for pro tips for the Forgotten Saga on the channel, you will find my video where I also have a timestamp or you can just watch it for or for general tips. That will also help you uh, Yeah, help you find it. So yeah, for people who just joined, the werewolf hat. Uh, 
I like it how if Aver like looks like this with this head on. It looks really, really good. So uh, that's kind of cool. Uh, so that one is at Red right now. And this bow, which is not that great, but if you move, you gain range damage. And this mount. This bird skin is at Reda. The Phoenix bird skin. And this mount. Where is the horse? Oh, it's over here. I think one of the coolest horses. You can get that as well for 150 opal. Now, let's real quick check out this one. Do I have enough? Uh, 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 I, I have this issue all the time. So yeah, you, I will almost maybe show that later. Next week. Or another stream that I might do later in the week. But uh, yeah, this one is out right now. And only, like, I don't think it's like, there are way better Helix Packs coming. Um, but this one is pretty good. Killing an ignited enemy so you can just use Fire Strike. Put that on your weapon. Kill enemies, get, cri get five critical hits. That's pretty wild. Don't forget your dailies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I can still do them, but... I have, like, 1600 Opal or something. PS4 froze. No, Skata. Oh, you're still on PS4. Uh. Wanna see that run? With that load times under 30 minutes. <laughs> yeah. On PS4 there, of course, uh, kind of crazy. But uh, thanks everyone for watching. I had a great time. That's a uh, kind of different uh, weekly reset. But I might do more runs uh, every weekly reset. If the time, like... Because next uh, in two weeks, Saints Row will be out. So I will be like... I will probably still stream for Valhalla. But it will probably be just a more regular uh, weekly reset stream. I just hope they do like a hardcore mode. Because already I'm like... I, un I fully like got the mode now. The only things that might be like fun to try are the armor sets. And maybe there are more secrets if you beat hell a couple of times. Although, from what I've seen, people are saying that uh, the, the cutscene at the end, as we saw, is kind of different. But apart from that. What's in Reddit's shop? I, I showed you it real quick. It's this mount. It's this headgear. It's this bird skin. And that's all you need to know. So, uh, this uh, headgear. Thanks everyone for joining. Hope you had a great one. We'll speak to you soon. We have some cool content planned, of course, for the rest of the week. And, uh, yeah, see you later. Whoop -a -poo. Can you do another playthrough with Forgotten Saga pack? Like, I do have that sword, but... Uh, XRV Dragon, appreciate the donation there. Yeah, we, we went in depth on that in my previous video on the sword. Goodbye, everyone.